Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a new game called Light Matter. Uh, this just popped up on Steam. Uh, fully released, I think, literally today. It has, at the time that I got it, one review, which said it was pretty good. So it's rather new, which is cool. And it seems to be um, a puzzle game similar to that of Portal, but focused more around, like, lights and things. Um, but of the actual gameplay, I've not seen too much. So let's, let's jump in and see what we got. Well, that doesn't look good. That's a, that's a brilliant way to start off, uh... I remember seeing something about there being a tour. Ba -dum. Lots of static. Where are we? What's going on? I fell all that way and I didn't hurt myself. It's good to know. <laughs> We're not gonna hurt ourselves by running. Uh, falling, diving. Final tram. I want to be on that tram. I, I have a feeling I don't want to be here. Glasses? Can I pick anything up? Can I interact with anything yet? Oh no, that's my tram! No! I'm late for work now! Booker! Oh, a camera! Camera, what we have set up here? Hmm, what do we think this is? Perhaps a Canon C200? With a little monitor on the back, and a nice smooth action tripod here. Hmm. Yes. Can we? Can we climb? Yeah, we can climb. Nice. Kettle. Why is there a kettle? Who has a kettle on the floor? It's bad for you. Bad for the kettle. Who's Virgil? Okay. Uh, I'm gonna. He sacrificed his leg. Jesus, what's down here? Unbelievable. Hi. There's more of you. Oh, hello. Uh, Hi. Were you a part of the public tour? You know what? I'm not sure. If so, I have just evacuated your tour guide. Don't panic. Now, your inability to follow evacuation orders is truly astounding. Rude. But I, I need didn't know you what was to going on. Attention. First off, walk through that door. This one? Oh, that one. Hey, that looks kind of like my camera. Anyway. Excellent. You have already exceeded my expectations. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, we've got another GLaDOS going on. I, I want to... You, these cameras. Following cameras. Okay, now what? Go through this green door here? But I want to pick it, pick, pick stuff. Let me pick stuff. Wait, it's dark in there. Um, um you, you might trip. Uh, let me light your path. The door requires two people to reopen. But there's proceed to my security manager's office. And that would be this way, I would assume. See, I think the thing about the the darkness, ness was. The dark kills you. Now I presume you know how buttons work. Wrong! Ooh, ooh. That was weird. Impressive! If you continue like this, I might just hire you to mop the floor. Oh wow, thank now you. Now scurry along, and you will reach the elevator to the exit. Oh. It's simple. It's simple. I don't like it when it, it takes away control of my, uh... My ability to see. I like being able to see. Let's go. I know it's difficult not to stare at the scientific wonder that is light matter, but the launch event is over. Okay. Don't okay. worry. My facility is sturdy. No need to be so. Get to uh, the elevator. I'm going. Stop being so pissy. Elevator. Elevagona. Excellent. Oh. The elevator will take you directly to our outpost. When you get there, journalists will immediately try to put words in your mouth. But stand strong and tell them that Virgil, the CEO of Light Matter Technologies, saved your life and that the side effects are under control. Goodbye. What side effects? 
Apart from the fact that shadows kill you. Yeah, I didn't think I knew about that. Didn't do. But I did. I knew. I knew this whole time. How do I leave? Let me leave! Oh, it would appear we are fallen. That's inconvenient. Light matter. That was the introduction to light matter. And, um, I'm getting a bit of deja vu. Um, I feel, I feel like we've woken up here in, in this way before. Open. Do I have to... What's out there? You see how the shadows are kind of like liquidy? That's pretty cool. That is pretty... Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. What do you want? Shadows are dangerous. Shadows are dangerous. Away from the shadow. Okay, I... Shadows are dangerous. Stay away from shadows. Like, you know, the edgy hedgehog is uh, armed and dangerous. Okay, if shadows kill, shadows are dangerous, we're gonna go... Look at it. I see, that's how shadows are dangerous. You touch them and you die. Ah, no! I did it again! I did it again! Okay, that's timed. Timed. Okay. Wait. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Go! And go. Nice. That looks cool. In a place where shadows are dangerous, there is, uh, there's not a lot of torches. I'd expect torches to, uh, be a commodity Excellent. around here. It's working. So, simple is no longer an option. Neither for you, nor for me. This was a monumental failure on behalf of my elevator technicians. <laughs> but don't worry. You will reach the exit of this facility, and they will reach the end of their employment. <laughs> an escape plan is in development. Until then, keep in mind that the shadows can kill you. Think... The floor is lava, just with shadows that absorb organic material. That's the part of the trailer that I heard. And uh, that's what made me really interested in this. Being able to... having, having to avoid shadows at all costs. Alright now, here's the plan. The elevator dropped you to the center of the mountain, and the only functioning exit is at the top. Follow the green exit signs and you'll get there. Okay, I can do that. Just do exactly as I say, and you will be fine. If you want to complain about that, well, I can't hear you. Just realize how fortunate you are. You've extended your tour through light matter technologies. Wait, why, that, why am I here? I just made a full circle. I didn't need to make a full circle. It's unfortunate that the board voted against installing microphones throughout the facility. Their main concern being ethical ramifications. Good <laughs> thing we still have cameras. Oh god, you can see me goof around and get stuck. Oh, that's not good, is it? That's that's a dangerous place to be. I don't mean to sound stupid, but you've you've got a nice perfect circle over here. I need to be over there. Correct. But how do I get there? You seem to enjoy turning things. So how about turning this situation around and getting out of there? That's... That's what I'm trying to do. I only have two buttons. And both of these two buttons do... Very little. God, it's a good job I've got the camera plugged in. Ooh! Ooh! Where the hell did that light come from? Oh, that light there. Aha! Uh -huh. I got it. I figured it out. It's all good. So that, these things, were blocking the light from that that was coming over here. That's a fucking strong spotlight. Jesus. Why, why aren't I casting- Why aren't I casting a shadow? That's the important question. Ah, excellent. Do you see that lamp down there? I do. Pick it up. Um. 
Oh my god, these this lamp is Whew. Handy, isn't it? Focus groups called it heavy and clunky. I called them weak and stupid. <laughs> In the hands of a capable miner, that lamp turns into one of their ah! finest tools. Cool. That allows me to do this. And get over here. Nice. See, that's a nice, simple puzzle that I can do. And now that's going to light up that way. Nice. Perfect. Nice. I like that. That was nice and simple. Listen, I know that the shadows <laughs> might look intimidating to you. A <laughs> deep black obsidian-like tar that will devour you whole. But they're just simple gravity-bound anomalies. A temporary side effect of light matter. Temporary you see, all of mankind's of greatest matter. breakthroughs had their kinks, and these kinks are manageable. If they weren't, I wouldn't be here in the facility fixing them. Boop. Okay. So, this, I assume, is where we get into the more fun side of stuff. Because now we have two which we can use and then we go this way nice you know that I was the first to wander through these caves? I didn't, Although not until I came now. with my former partner Arthur I was the one who discovered the photon crystals you might have heard that the side effects of those same crystals cost me my leg yes Wrong. I conquered a mountain for the first photon crystal Sheer persistence and willpower cost me my leg. Oh. A small price to pay for light matter. Okay, good to know. Can we pop this a bit more uh, this way? And then... Uh, I'm not going to be able to jump over there. Damn, okay. Oh, what I can do though is I can do this. Take this. Aha! There we go. Sorted. Have you go there, take you, and bring you with me. Nice. And then put you there. And off we go. Brilliant. Now you're thinking with... With light. Hard portals. Ooh. Ah, wow. there it is. Now, since you missed your tour... That giant beam of light you see is light matter. The source of that beam we call the core, a collection of massive photon crystals. It is so powerful that it shakes the very foundation of this facility. I still remember my first successful prototype. The beam seemed so solid, it looked like light had become matter. I built on that, and now look at it. A sustainable and renewable energy source that will save humanity. It's certainly going to do yes, something. the launch today failed. Hmm, but hmm, these shadows hmm, will hmm. not deter me from bringing light matter into fruition. You sound like you're playing some stupid game. Ooh, that's a bat. That bat's coming with me. That's a button. New Tom, button. Okay, what's in here? Another button. Towards the exit, okay. Now that I think about it, where were you during the launch event? All guests were taken directly to the tram, so you must have snuck away somehow. Hmm. What exactly were you doing? I have absolutely no Wait. idea. Are you a health and safety inspector? <laughs> <laughs> The irony that you didn't notice the blaring sounds and flashing lights. That's a problem with safety procedures. They could never be idiot proof. Rude. Very, very rude of you. Yeah, so I can walk down here. But I can't press this button. I need to be able to press that button. This door is closed. Anything worth knowing about? No? Okay, what if I press the button again? I've pressed the button once, yes. Oh, that closes the door. Inspector, I regret that during 
the launch event, bankers, investors, and government officials died. But there are things one cannot predict. Shadows devouring people being one of them. You know what, I don't think I'm a health inspector. I got it, I got it. I'm not this dense all the time. I promise. But I got it. So we take this. We take this one that we find. Walk over to here. So I take this, I can walk over here and then use this to shine down there. And then take this one, go down here. I got it. And then we go across here. Then we hop over here press this button to open this up and then we go back do that and then we can walk there we go I know what I'm doing I'm not stupid why would you even think that it's it's yeah what's in the next room so health and safety inspector let me do your job for you you see that giant piece of metal moving back and forth? It's a top-grade mineral decontaminator. I installed it as soon as I heard that my employees were losing their hair. Once installed, cellular degradation fell by 37%. Hmm, good to know. What's the, the, the catch? Wait, does the light still travel through? For your information, saving humanity puts a lot of stress on my workers. As do my 12-hour no, okay. work days. Point is, there are many reasons for hair loss. Good to know. Um, ooh. So we want to go this way. Ah, where, where did you come from? Oh, yeah. That thing. The thing that wobbles back and forth. So I'm going to have to throw you there and then whoa, run over here. Well, this is safe. And then run over here. Nice. Nothing, nothing super challenging so far. Things that have taken a bit of time for me, me slow brain to figure out. Excellent. But we Our got it. Our time together is almost at an end. Ooh. There's a bridge right around the corner. Cross it, and you will be on a direct path to sunshine. And my security manager, James. Oh yes, he was evacuated as well. <laughs> I wouldn't dare risk his health and safety. Oh, well, that's nice of you. Be careful with my lamps. No. At Light Matter Technologies, we treat our inanimate objects with respect. Not like those monsters of aperture science. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, love it. So, canonically then, this is in the same universe as, as Portal. That's great. That is amazing. So you can go there. So then... I can pop you on there and... Press this. If you're wondering why I built a no, lab no, inside I can't do a that. mountain... Resilience. It was here before me, and it will be here after me. Just look around you, Inspector. We had an unprecedented event, and this living, breathing monument to science still stands. What if I put that sort of there? Before meeting James, don't be too intimidated by his <laughs> physique. Why not? He is the human equivalent of this mountain. Well built, dependable, and resilient. Well, that's good to know, isn't it? I need to be here. So in order for that to happen, I need to pop over to pop pop, pop over to me. Yeah? Set up me, me a little lamp, which. I I'm not quite sure how these lamps are powered. Um, it's quite impressive. Can I... Have I just been over some... No, I haven't been over complicating it. God damn it! You can't jump on the barrier, which is what I wanted to do. I can't jump over this. Can I set this up very close to the edge? No, but I can jump in. You know, James is a useful man. During the evacuation, he was tossing people over shadows to safety. Yes, risks were involved, but he saved people. We share the same philosophy in that regard. 
And again, I can't, I keep wanting to like throw stuff over there, but I know I can't. Because now I can set that up here. On here. Send that on its way. Jump over here, jump over here. Pick it up from over here. <sighs> we got it. That was a good one. That was, that was a good puzzle. A real brain twister. And then put you there, and then go through here. Ah, you found a solution. I did. Excellent. You'll leave, and I'll be able to focus. Ah, oh, the bridge collapsed. <laughs> That's why I don't trust you inspectors. I built it up to code. Who even to said I'm an inspector? Required of me, yet what good did it do? Let me figure out your options. None. Diddly squat. I really don't have time for this. I have nothing. The new door will be open soon enough. This one? A moment, inspector. This one. This one? Yes, James. This is Virgil. I need... James, So far, down, I really James. like this. Just... Punch something. We will find your cat later. Now oh. focus. I need details for a new evacuation route. James lost his cat. The inspector didn't make it across the bridge. It collapsed. Must have pushed the button too hard. I'm not quite sure that's how bridges work. Uh huh. I push so. button over here. Plan out the Thing over the here route. breaks. And do it faster than last time. Goodbye, James. Inspector, the door is open. Run along now. Go, 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 Thank you. I can't grab this one. A hard hat? A helmet? Open. Open. Ew. Ew, what is this? No, 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 no. Ah. Okay. Let's try this again. Huh. Nice. Now I have to stay in the middle. Go this way, away from you. And then. Huh. Yeah. Jump over it as All it's right, coming towards Inspector. you. Nice. Your failure to push a button has resulted in a change of plans. Ooh. You will be I didn't a fail to push the button. I pushed that elevator. button perfectly. What's over here? Now, okay, cool. Nothing show yet. some gratitude for the amount of effort I put into keeping you alive. Keep an eye out for James's cat, Lux. I will. And James wants to know that he's safe. You see, James can't function properly when he's sad. I just, I just fall. I will keep an eye out for James's cat. And as for your keeping me alive, I've only died about twelve times. So. uh Good job on that. I didn't even need to jump while it was moving. Eesh. Eesh. Right. What we're gonna do is we're gonna pop you on here like this. Hmm. You didn't go anywhere near as far as I thought you would. And I can't jump over you there. Oh, but I can pop you down here. <laughs> right, right up to the line. Hey, yeah, yeah, nice. And then with this one, I can pop it on here, like this, and this will give me a path to cross. Yeah. And yeah, nice. That's that problem solved. What is... He said he found this place, right? Oh god, I'm gonna need to jump on it. So, what was here beforehand? That's the question. He found the lab. Listen, I have a limited amount of patience. What was here beforehand? this detour is exhausting it. Yep. I'm Light sorry. matter demands my attention. So, you'll be on your own for a little while. 
Just know that I admire your persistence. Thank you. Everything I like you being be alive. True, I would hate my life if I were you. Now, oh. you'll survive as long as you stick to the green exit signs. Good luck. It's a good job you're not me then, isn't it? See, what I liked about Portal is that it had a very sinister secret that it was trying to keep, keep away from you. But so far, uh, well, this doesn't seem to have necessarily a sinister secret. Just, uh, well, I mean, it's it's not a secret. It's just out in the open very quickly. Put this here. Hop over here. Hello, James. What if I do this? Off you go. Whee! Hey! I did it. Whoop. Whoop. There we go. Crisis averted, problem solved, and we are... Watch the void. Out of here! Unless I go over here. Ah, so here it is. Stick to the green signs, and we'll be fine. But what if we don't? Hey guys, added to me here from the future, after all this has been recorded. There's about an hour and a half of uh, gameplay altogether. Um, and as much as I want to put it all in one video, uh, that's going to be a bit much for my computer to export and then upload. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this video and cut it into uh, two, maybe three videos, depending on you know how quickly I figure out the puzzles uh, and how uh, and how much they get edited down by. So for now, this is going to be the end of this episode, and I'll see you about next episode either. Next episode is going to be the last one of this chunk, or there's going to be one more uh, using this. But for now, I'll carry on editing this for the rest of today. But it's going to come out in two or three parts, because it's a bit too much for my little computer to handle. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Give it a like if you liked it. And until next time, did you know I'm English? Cheerio.